my channel and if you're new, hello. So today I wanted to do dumb life hacks that you should never try. Over the past like two years, a lot of people are doing life hacks videos and things that will change your life and things you need to try. So I thought it'd be fun if we did something a little bit different and we did dumb life hacks you should never try. Yeah. But before we get into this, make sure if you are not subscribed yet to click that subscribe button. It would mean a whole lot to me. And if you like the video, please give it a big thumbs up at the end. That would make me so happy. Hey guys, so I filmed the rest of the video before my birthday, and my birthday has since passed. It was just on Monday, November 14th, and si oh, we can see a Maddie McTooth in the mirror. Since then, I actually have gotten so many more clothes, and this video happens to be sponsored by Poshmark, and I'm using Poshmark to sell my clothes. You can actually sign up, you can sell your own clothes, you can buy clothes. All of the clothes are usually 50 to 70% off of what they would normally be in a store, and if you are like me and you wanna sell a bunch of extra clothes that you have in your closet, maybe some things you've never used, the process of selling an item is actually really fun. You get to style your item, you get to take a picture of it, so when you make sure it looks really cute, and you can take the picture through the app, so it's really easy. And then, you know, you fill out the details, write a little description, voila, instead of throwing out some clothes, you made some cash. So this is my store and my listing. I really hope that you guys check it out. Make an offer. So guys, make sure that you check out, download, and use Poshmark. The link is in my description bar below, and I actually have a special code for you to use as well, so when you buy items, check out with my code. So if you guys uh, purchase some of my clothes. I will actually be sending out free clothes to some of my buyers. Who doesn't like free things along with cheap things? I think everybody does. Like everybody does. <laughs> Maddie does too. Look for things. What? So thank you to Poshmark again for sponsoring this video and now back on to our regular content. Let's go. Hack number one. Using a blow-up doll or a stuffed animal to pretend that it's a baby so you can use the carpool lane to get to your events faster. In LA there's always traffic but around the holidays things get like Crazy. And believe it or not, I actually know people that have gotten like a stuffed monkey and put it in a baby's car seat to pretend they have a baby. So if they use the carpool lane, like a cop will be like, oh, that's a baby, she's fine. Don't do that. Don't get in trouble. They find out, they know. And then that's like a, almost a $400 fine. Not worth it. Don't play back. Don't do it. Hack number two, scamming workout subscription services. What is the holidays you're trying to get in shape, trying to look good? I don't I don't know if you've ever used ClassPass, but there are other subscriptions like that too, or services where you can pay a certain amount a month and go to different studios like a certain amount of times per month. And usually places like this will let you try the service for like $20 for the first month, but after that it's $120. I have a friend who did the first month free trial for $20 and then signed up again with a different email to try to get the next month for $20 again. They found out after like the third time when they realized it was the same credit card and she was like, my little sister is under 18 and doesn't have a credit card, so she's just borrowing mine. It's like, girl, they got cameras, they can see it's you coming in every time. Now she's banned from it. This also applies to food subscriptions services like Blue Apron and stuff because that same friend also did it for Blue Apron. I'm pretty sure they caught on to her too and also banned her for that. So be a good person. If you can't afford it, just don't do it. <laughs> don't do it. Hack number three. Waiting to buy your presents to the last minute. So sometimes people will think that the price will drop last minute or they can get a better deal out of it. Whatever. Maybe they're just lazy and want to like avoid the crowds on the actual like month leading up to it and think that the day before things will be better. Don't do it, okay? Because usually the prices like skyrocket and everything sells out. Go Christmas shopping and holiday shopping now. Get it over and done with. That way every single person that you care about will get the right gifts or know that you really love them and care about them. Hack number five, piggybacking off of hack number four, giving uh, friends pets as gifts. That is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. I actually know people that have gotten like two of my good friends. I think it was a hamster or something. Oh my gosh, what a horrible thing. Not only are you making someone take care of something, but it's also gonna cost them money to like buy them food and upkeep it. What if they have a full-time job and can't take care of it, and then it dies? That is horrible. <laughs> no, don't do that, that's dumb. I don't care how lonely your friend says she is. I don't care how upset that her boyfriend broke up with her. She doesn't wanna be smelling hamster poop. No, bad idea. Just bad idea. This next one is probably the most ratchet life hack that I heard of. To cover up your zits with Christmas bling. Oh God. No, that is the weirdest, trashiest, ugliest thing I've ever heard of. Don't do that. You're gonna look like a fool, okay? Just don't. Bling ended with the end of the flip phones, okay? No. And hack number eight, carry a huge bag around with you. So you have room for all your stuff. 
Now I hate this idea because I've gone through like the really big tote bags and I just think it's miserable. I think there's nothing worse than when you're shopping around the holidays and you're carrying not only all the clothes, but like a big tote bag of things falling out, your scarves, your, like why do you have eight granola bars in your bag? When I have a bigger bag, I just find a reason to put more stuff that I don't need in it. So in the holiday spirit, I thought that I would give you a discount code for my favorite purse at the moment that is literally like the perfect size. I suggest you guys all check it out. And it is a bag um, by Teddy Blake, and it is honestly like my favorite bag. They reached out to me and were like, yo, do you want to like try one of our bags? And I was like, all right. I did not expect it to love it this much. Leather and then suede on the sides, but you can like make it pop out like this. It is just like so freaking cute. There's a latch in here that'll make sure everything stays in your bag and doesn't fall out. It holds so much stuff and you can hold it like this or use it as a crossbody. They just sent me the bag. They're not paying me to say this. I just wanted to say this and they gave me a coupon code for you guys or a discount code. So I'm gonna leave all that below along with the exact bag that I have, like the details, what it's called and stuff and the size and the website to get the bags. Check it out if you want and to your Christmas wish list. So let me know which life hack in the comments below you think is like the most absurd. For me, honestly, I think the, the gem pimple thing is like the most ridiculous. But I love you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please remember to subscribe, give it a thumbs up. It's my birthday, it would mean a lot to me. And also follow me on all my social media, which I will link in the bottom bar. Please let me know what video to do next. And I love you, I will see you later. Bye! Peace.